Hello everyone, uh, my name is Greg Viss with SimVS, here with my colleague Jake DeFayette, and uh, we'd like to provide you with an overview of our system today. So we have a diverse um, ecosystem for simulation, and uh, we, today we are going to run a healthy simulation scenario, and it's a cardiac medication scenario. We're going to use three of our systems as we run this scenario. We're going to use our um, monitor, hospital monitor, our nurse call system, and the first in the world IV pump. And this is um, a preview of a webinar we're going to do on February 6th with Healthy Simulation. We're going to do a deep dive on this scenario. So today is just a quick overview of the scenario. So we will dive into the scenario. Um, we have uh, the scenario physiology from the scenario pre-programmed on the instructor tablet. In this scenario, I'll, provide, I'll be the provider. Jake will be the instructor, changing the physiology. And um, the IV, so a little bit of a background. This patient is in for cardiac condition. The patient is on Esmolol. Um, and so we will start the scenario now. So our nurse call system lets the provider know that there's a problem. They will come in, cancel the alarm, Take a look at the monitor, we can see that the patient is, is worse, tacky. Uh, Mr. Julius, uh, what, what's going on? Okay, so I know that I have standing orders to um, increase the Esmolol, which I'm gonna do right now. Come over to our pump, and I'm going to um, adjust it, and we'll adjust the rate, um, et cetera, et cetera. Now, so then, after that's done, you know, obviously we're compressing time in this scenario, but we can see an improvement. And uh, so that is a very quick overview of how we integrate three systems, our assessment system, a communication system, and therapy through the IV pump. So we have a little bit more time that we'd like to take some time to show you a little bit more detail about uh, each of these devices. We'll start with the IV pump, as I mentioned, um, this is the world's first IV pump simulator. And uh, so we simulate um, four different, um, we d simulate four different types of interfaces. The four most popular, the Alaris, Infusimat, Sigma, and Plum. Let's go to the Alaris. So the interfaces look exactly like the uh, real product and they work exactly like the real product. We can turn it on and it'll go through its sequence and for brevity, um, we'll, we'll, we won't show everything, but I would like to show people the three, the interfaces. So that's our Alaris. And here we have the Infusomat, the Sigma, and the Plum, the four most common interfaces. Late, so for all of the pumps, we can do primary, secondary, and bolus, volume-based drugs, um, weight-based drugs, dose-based drugs, and you know we, we understand that people use many refurbished uh, uh, pumps, but on those refurbished pumps, it's very hard to add drugs to the drug library. With our system, there's a built-in drug library. You have total control about adding new drugs to the system. So that's an overview. We hope you're gonna, we're gonna talk more about some of the other equipment, but we hope you'll join us February 6th for a deep dive on this scenario. Hi everyone, I'm Jake from SimVS. I'm going to do a quick overview of a SimVS simulated monitor ecosystem. Everything from low fidelity point of care devices to higher fidelity ventilators, telemetry monitors, and kind of everything in between. Our systems start off at approximately $3,000, then uh, increase from there. So whatever your simulation use case may be, we do have a monitor for you.